time for another Adulting Hacks on KSAT News at 9. And joining me now is Rick Monroe with Maverick Whiskey. And we're going to be doing a little bit of Whiskey 101. Some tips to know for people like myself that think they know a little bit about whiskey, but probably don't know as much as this guy right here. So Rick, what's some of the first things that people need to know when they sort of step out and they want to try some new whiskeys? First thing most people don't realize is that whiskey comes off the still clear. Mm -hmm. and so all the color that you see, and you go to the liquor store, you pick up a bottle of whiskey, it's brown, right? So all that color comes from the barrel. This is called a Glencairn glass. This is great for, for nosing and sipping okay. uh, spirits. Basically what this does is it focuses all those aromas right at the right at the tip of the glass. Okay. Right. And so you, you pour yourself a little, uh, you know, one or two ounces and then let it sit for five to 10 minutes, let it come up to room temperature. And as the, the whiskey oxidizes, as it interacts with the air, uh, you know, more of those aromatic compounds will be released and, okay. and you'll get to smell and, and taste uh, more of what's, you know, hiding in that liquid. When you're sampling whiskey neat, just add a little drop of water and it'll, it'll help to, okay. to proof it down a little bit and cut some of that bite. Yeah. On the back of the bottle, uh, you know, it'll say where it's distilled. So this one's mm -hmm. in, distilled by us and bottled by us okay. uh, here in San Antonio and it's distilled from grain. Some companies source their whiskey. There's nothing wrong with that, but you know, some of them try and hide that fact. What are some of the biggest questions that people ask you uh, being the head distiller here at Maverick Whiskey. Everybody wants to know the mash bill and, and that, or the, okay. yeah, or the grain <laughs> bill. And so that's just the ingredients you use to make the whiskey from. Most of our whiskeys are made from corn, rye, and barley. And I enjoy, you know, a nice glass of whiskey with like a steak and some, you, uh, you know, some risotto and some yeah. asparagus. You know, ask your bartenders. They, they know a lot about the products and, okay. you know, they can help you out and yeah. kind of guide you. On your on your tasting journey. So, should we try this? Sure. Out? Yeah. Okay. I'm very curious about Cheers. that. That was uh, good. <laughs> <laughs> A little heat on it. Oh yeah, definitely. 